Nikon's Z-Series has become synonymous with cutting-edge technology, exceptional image quality, and a durable design that meets the needs of professionals and enthusiasts alike. Since its debut, the Z-Series has reshaped Nikon's position in the mirrorless camera market, offering a compelling alternative to industry giants like Sony and Canon. The Z7 II, released in 2020, solidified this reputation with a high-resolution 45. 7 megapixel sensor, dual speed 6 processors, and a versatile autofocus system that catered to a wide range of shooting scenarios. Fast forward nearly two years, and the photography world is buzzing with rumors of its successor, the Nikon Z7 III. If the speculation proves accurate, this new model could represent a significant leap forward, building on the strong foundation of the Z7 II while introducing innovative features aimed at both professional photographers and filmmakers. In this video, we'll explore the most exciting rumors about the Z7 III, including its design, sensor, performance upgrades, and potential pricing. Let's dive in. Nikon's Z series cameras are celebrated for their ergonomic designs, and the Z7 III is expected to maintain this tradition while offering meaningful improvements. Early rumors suggest the new model will retain the sleek, comfortable body of its predecessor with refinements that make it even more user-friendly during extended shooting sessions. The Z7 III is rumored to feature a dual-axis, multi-angle LCD screen, a major improvement over the Z7II's tilting display. This flexible design would make composing shots from challenging angles much easier, whether you're shooting from low perspectives or capturing overhead views. Alongside this, the electronic viewfinder, EVF, is expected to see an upgrade, potentially offering higher resolution and refresh rates than the Z7II's already impressive 3.69 million dot EVF. These enhancements would provide photographers with an immersive and crystal clear view of their compositions. As with the Z7 II, the Z7 III is likely to feature a robust, weather-sealed body designed to withstand harsh environments. Nikon's commitment to durability has always been a standout feature, and the Z7 III should be no exception. Meanwhile, the overall button layout and control scheme will likely remain intuitive, with minor adjustments based on feedback to improve usability further. One of the most talked about rumors surrounding the Nikon Z7 III is its potential to introduce a revolutionary sensor. Reports suggest Nikon is testing a 90.75 megapixel BSI CMOS sensor with an 88.48 megapixel usable area. This would be a dramatic leap from the Z7II's 45.7 megapixel sensor, doubling the resolution and promising unparalleled detail and clarity in images. The rumored sensor could also feature a cross-pixel super-pixel packing mode, designed to simulate the effect of a low-pass filter at a reduced resolution of 10.1 megapixels. This innovation would minimize aliasing and enhance performance in low-light conditions two areas where professional photographers demand top-tier results. Additionally, the Z7 III may offer four image size options with raw capture in both large and small formats, providing versatility for different shooting scenarios and workflows. A partially stacked sensor design is also on the table, enabling faster readout speeds without compromising image quality. Combined with advancements in Nikon's image processing technology, the Z7 III is poised to deliver exceptional image quality, making it a strong contender for landscape, studio, and commercial photographers who need the highest level of detail. Performance upgrades are a cornerstone of the Nikon Z7 III rumors. At its core, the camera is expected to feature the powerful Xpeed 7 processor a significant step up from the dual Xpeed 6 processors in the Z7 II. This new processing engine could deliver faster image processing, improved responsiveness, and enhanced overall performance. In terms of connectivity, the Z7 III is rumored to support both 2.4 and 5 GHz Wi-Fi, as well as Bluetooth LE, ensuring seamless file transfers and reliable remote control options. Dual card slots are expected to remain, offering compatibility with CFX Press Type-B and SD UHS-2 cards for flexible storage and backup solutions. 
videographers and content creators will also appreciate the retention of an HDMI Type-A port, which is essential for external recording and display functionality. The Nikon Z73's rumoured speed capabilities are impressive, with the mechanical shutter allowing for continuous shooting at up to 14 frames per second FPS. This would enable photographers to capture action-packed moments with precision and clarity. For even faster shooting, the electronic shutter could push the limits to 20 FPS in FX format. Additionally, ultra-high speed modes such as C30, C60 and C120 might be included for JPEG and HEAF shooting. On the video front, the Z73 is shaping up to be a powerhouse. Rumours suggest the camera could offer 12-bit and RAW recording at resolutions as high as 12K, 30fps, alongside 8K, 60fps with a crop, and 4K, 120fps. Standard video modes are expected to include 8K, 30fps and 4K, 120fps in H.265, 10-bit format, catering to a wide range of professional videography needs. Professional filmmakers will likely appreciate advanced features like ProRes 422 HQ10 bit recording at 4K 60p, ProRes RAW support, and Nikon's N-Log2 profile for greater dynamic range. Additional tools such as fine shutter angle control and frame rate splitting could further solidify the Z73's position as a versatile option for high-end video production. Autofocus is another area where the Nikon Z73 could shine. The camera is rumoured to feature a dual-stream autofocus system powered by advanced AI algorithms. This system is expected to surpass the autofocus capabilities of even Nikon's flagship Z8 and Z9 models, offering faster, more accurate focusing in diverse conditions. Image stabilisation is also anticipated to see a major upgrade. The Z73 could include an 8-stop in body stabilisation system, improving on the Z72's 5-stop stabilisation. This enhancement would provide greater stability for both stills and video, particularly in challenging shooting environments. For video, an upgraded gyroscope for electronic stabilisation could complement the in-body system, ensuring smooth and professional results. Additionally, Nikon's Focus Point VR system, recently introduced on the ZF, might make its way into the Z7 III, further enhancing stability. While Nikon has yet to officially announce the Z7 III, its release may be imminent. Historically, Nikon has paired its Z7 releases with the Z6 series, and with the Z6 III recently announced, the Z7 III could follow soon. As for pricing, the Z73 is expected to see a noticeable increase over the Z72, likely starting around $2,500. This reflects its advanced features and position as a high-end mirrorless camera aimed at professionals. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on the Nikon Z73? Share your expectations in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the latest updates on camera news and reviews. Thanks for watching.